couple days ago, my mom was driving my friend's house. That bitch was listening to country ass music. I said, bitch, turn that shit off. She said, bitch, you talk to me over here like that. What's up? The nipples off your chest. I said, bitch, drop me off right here then. So I scooted the rest of the way. Got out of the car. That bitch drove off. I started walking. I realized I forgot my damn scooter. It started to piss me off. I decided to hitch ride. Some bitch pulled over the side of the road and said, hey, you selling tomatoes? I said, bitch, does it look like I'm selling tomatoes? I said, you better get the hell out of here. You know what's good for you. That bitch drove off real quick. Took out one of the tomatoes I was selling. Threw it out of the car. Bitch came back. Got out of the car. Later, I sat my poking her in the eye. Pulled my pants down. Took a shit in the face. <laughs> bitch, now tell me, is that unforgivable? I woke up. It was Sunday morning. Rain is falling. I decided to clip my toenails. I went to the backyard. I took out my socks and my feet smell like shit. Then I looked to my right. I was like, Johnny, what the hell are you doing here? Then he says, I just took a shit in your boxers. I was like, that's fucking nasty. Take that shit off. He took them off. I looked at his legs. I said, you got some nice ass tan legs. He said, it's not, it's not my tan. It's my shit. I said, that's fucking nasty. Get the hell out of here. As soon as he left, I went to Walmart to get some new boxers. Before I went to the store, some idiots asked me if, they, if I wanted to donate money to some charity shit. I was like, I was like, shit, no, I ain't got no money. I sent these shitty boxers. I got the boxers. I threw them, I threw them in the box. I was like, yeah, bitch, you like that shit. Then I went inside. I was looking for my whitey tidies. I looked, I looked everywhere. I couldn't find shit. I saw this little cunt. I said, hey, bitch, come here. She worked there. And I asked her, I said, come here. And she said, hello, my name is Dee. Man, how may I help you? I was like, bitch, I didn't ask you what your name was. I said, and I told her, I said, bitch, go get me some whitey tidies in the men's section. She got me some whitey tidies. I went in the fitting room. I tried them on. They didn't fit. I took a shit. I put it back in the bag. I went outside. I gave her the bag. And she said, is this shit? And she said, and I said, yeah, bitch, it's shit. She goes, are you sure? And I said, bitch, ask me again. She asked me again. I slapped that bitch in the face. She got knocked out on the floor. I dragged her into the employee room. I took off all her clothes. I put those shit panties on her face. When I looked down, she had a big ass dick. I was like, bitch, you have a big ass dick. And she's like, mm, okay. I was like, no, bitch, it ain't okay. The dick's bigger than mine. So, I picked up a knife. I put that shit down. I picked up some scissors. I cut the hair off her ass. And I put it between her eyebrows. I glued it on her eyebrows and I said, bitch, if you ever shave this shit off, I'm gonna cut the hair off your dick and glue it to your head and cut the hair off your head and glue it to your dick. Just to make sure she didn't shave it off. And came back the next day. When I went up to her, I was like, what the fuck? I was like, what'd you do here? I said, I said what'd you do? And she said, mm, I shaved it off. I was like, I, she's like, mm, I shaved off my ass. I was like, bitch, you're an idiot. I slapped that bitch in the face. She got knocked out again. <laughs> she got knocked out again. I dragged in the room. I did. I said. I did what I said I was gonna do to her. Now you tell me. <sighs> Is that unforgivable? Back on a Monday when I was 16, I wrote a fake note to get out of Bible school with no signature. That same day, I went to the local club. I went up to the bartender, asking for the manliest drink. A cup of milk with a twisty straw and a fruity umbrella. Asking for some Oreos, double stuff. He told me he didn't have any. So I went to the local liquor store down the street, got my Oreos, came back, did my man business.
After I was done, I went to the dance floor. Some fat bitch started grinding on me. She laid a big ass fart. I told that bitch if she do that again, my finger, her ass. So she started grinding on me again. And this time it was worse. She started. I took my fingers, shoved up her ass, gave her a McTwisty. <laughs> took it out, gave her a dirty Sanchez. Now you tell me, is that unforgivable? Now you tell me. Huh? Is that unforgivable? Now you tell me. Huh? Is that is that unforgivable? <laughs> <laughs> now you tell me. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> now you tell me. Huh? <laughs> now you tell me. Huh? Is that unforgivable? <laughs> Is that unforgivable? Now you tell me. Huh? Is that unforgivable? Back on the Monday when I was 16, I wrote a fake letter to get out of Bible school. With no signature. That same day, I went to the local club. Oh, now you tell me. Huh? Is that unforgivable? 